Tip and toe. I'm not going to lie to you. I, I Like, right now they saying they caught two of the people that I was with that, um, what's his name from Cali? Damn, I forgot his name, though. He was hang, he used to hang with, um, with nothing. They just caught two people for that case. You see what I'm saying? It's like, it's like, what's the point of all these cases? You don't notice they all getting solved. Growing up, people used to kill people. Never get solved. You don't notice all these rapper murders. Then all of them get solved. It don't matter if it's a six month later, a year later, two years later. Somebody gonna come and say something, bro. Somebody gonna talk. Because you know why? This ain't real beef. This is clout beef. This ain't no real beef. This clout beef. Guys killing over clout. Why you think when they kill, I got to tell somebody. What the hell? If I don't tell nobody, who's going to know? Hmm? If I don't tell nobody, who's going to know? If I kill somebody and don't let nobody know, don't let the crew know, I ain't going to get no points. I ain't no stepper. I got to get out there. Yeah. Shout out to everybody locked in. Yeah, I got to get out there and let them boys know who I, who I done whoop woo who I, who I done, you feel me? Because that's what I'm doing it for. Remember, I, I ain't really got beef with this person. I ain't really got beef with this artist. But the thing is, it's on wax. We got to live by that though. And, and you know they all getting solved. Like it don't matter who get killed. A year later, six months later, somebody gonna go tell the police. You feel me? Cause he might get caught with something. He might catch a gun charge. I remember one time, one of my people from Throwback did a carjacking. Jumped out on somebody. That's when, you know, with the big rims, people wanted your rims and shit. So my dog jumped out on the person. Took the whole car. Me, man, actually, the person ran and left the car. Then, you know, my dog jumped in the car and took off. So anyway, they went and stripped the car at somebody else's house. It was the lookout man. He was just a lookout. He ain't had nothing to do with the situation. And one thing about when you snitching, the paperwork is going to come out. So apparently, he was driving with no license. He had two license suspensions driving on. Did you know that guy told the police, I know about a carjacking that happened in such and such. The police like, well, the police like, wait a minute, I'm taking you to jail for suspended license. You telling me all this? The police don't even believe it. So guess what? You feel me? They done looked the shit up. A, a carjacking did went down yesterday. Now they go grip. My dog up. This man didn't want to go to jail for a license, man. Told a whole big criminal case. He was a lookout, man. You feel me? He could have went to jail too, but remember, he snitched. They ain't care about him, like, telling no more. I mean, um, like, he was there. Bitch, you you help, you help solve a case. We're not even in that city. That's not even our case. So we're going to get bonuses for just free snitching. So that's what's going on with these, with these Merkins, like, like, when these young niggas are grown, even grow, don't just think it's young niggas. Grown niggas out here doing dumb shit too. So when a nigga shoot a nigga, and he can't keep that shit quiet, I gotta let everybody know. You don't see how shit and dog. Like people don't know we living in a society where you can't really do shit. Bitches be snitching on social media. Bitch, you might go rob a store. You ever see somebody on the comments like, man, is that Ray Ray? Man, I look just like Ray Ray, man. The nigga I know off 6th Street. Bitch, be snitching on you right in the comments. Because another thing, y'all don't understand. I don't care all that smacking shit everybody be talking. They steppers. They do they doing this. Once somebody lose their life, 
you, you see some of the gangsters motherfuckers switch that shit up, man, ready to call the police, man. You feel me? Like, once somebody lose their life, the most gangster nigga ready to call the police because he his mind like, damn, you done kill him? Bitch, I got to snitch. Bitch, I got to get this nigga off the street somehow. And that's the, like that's like a different way of killing a nigga. Bitch, you go down for murder. Bitch, you gone for a minute. So you feel me? So it's like, it's crazy out here, bro. All these rappers getting killed. All they cases getting solved. Because why? Niggas is telling other homies, homeboys, other rappers. Like, like. A rapper gonna tell another rapper in another city, man, I done had this nigga smack. I'm smacking this. But that rapper might be police. How you know that rapper ain't police? So you think all these rappers, regular motherfuckers, the same way the street got police. You don't think the rap gang got police? So you think all these rapping ass niggas on point? You think because they music sound real good and you singing that shit word for word, these motherfuckers ain't police too? Everybody police out here some type of way, nigga. Goons, regular niggas, street niggas, rappers. So I don't know why rappers give other rappers passes. If you a rapper, you out here smacking, doing this. You can't be telling no next nigga because you feel his song. Bitch, that nigga might be working with the DEA, FBI. Bitch, he might be on papers right now. Bitch, this case going to get him off their radar. Well, oh, shit. And people don't know. That's like the real like meaning of then sow your soul to the devil like motherfucking they got you working you ready to testify on everybody cause why you done got caught in that situation and that's when it was like a a real game now y'all making it easy man most yo, yo you ever see when somebody kill somebody on social media okay you see little Timmy and what's his name you feel me for, for, the, for the King Von situation little Timmy ain't getting no cool points he got cool points for his little homeboys, but as far as the internet, man, they miss King Von. They want King. They saying, man, take, take, what's his name? Bring us back King Von. Yeah, bro. So it's like, it's, it's like, I don't care how tough motherfuckers make it sound. Let somebody get killed over the situation. They're going to be like, no. Then they want to see you go to jail because you, you rapping about this shit. Now, you got the points, but you in jail. Now, everybody going to get out. Like, what's his name that's going crazy right now? What's his name that just came out? Let me, uh, what's his name again? That just came out of jail from Chicago. Lil' J. Now, everybody going to be a Lil' J, catch big charges and get out. Now, everybody get that second chance. Now, everybody, everybody get lucky like that. Look at, look at what's his name right now. You feel me? You feel me? What's his name from Alabama? Country, um... Damn, man, what's his name? He be he freestyling heavy in jail right now. You feel me? You feel me? So it's like he from Alabama. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Touch your nose, leave, leaving the comment. Y'all know what I'm talking about. So it's like they they, they the, um R.I.P. to his grandmother and grandfather. You feel me? Oh, I'm gonna let y'all know right now. I'm going to let you know right now. Yeah, dog. So, that shit there was tough when you're a rapper. You feel me? Like, like you feel me? Like, you rapping out here getting to that money? Honeycomb Brazy. Honeycomb. Yeah, you feel me? We talking about Honeycomb. Sorry about that. They're like, look at the Honeycomb situation, bro. You out here. But remember, he had that shit follow you. Honeycomb been having beef before he started spitting bars. And God damn it, that motherfucker could spit. Honeycomb could spit. But look how that shit catch up to you, bro. Look how that shit catch up to you. You feel me? Now he motherfucking locked up. Family dead, people playing with the money. He freestyling back to back. That's all he could do. All in white, look like he got bulletproof papers on. Make sure he is like, this shit crazy. Mm -mm -mm. 
And that's what I'm saying. It's like, all this ain't really worth it. All this stuff that's going on, what's the point of all this right here? What, what's the point of rappers? And, and, and it's not really, a, see, people keep saying it's a rap thing. This shit was going on before the rap. It was, there was gang banging already. There was shoot them up, bang, bang already. But the thing is now, everybody done find rap a way to make money. So it's like a dope game. It's just like on the block. Once everybody on the block selling dope, this my people. you got people claiming the corner. This is my corner. Nah, that's my corner. We're going to shoot them up. We're going to fight for that corner. We're going to kill for that corner. So now it's about whoever the strongest survive. So that's what's going on. All this shit, like, you feel me? Like, rap just added on to it and make it more worse, but... This shit crazy, bro. Like, you feel me? Shit going on. Shit getting... And, like, me, I'm really tripping about, like, bitch, like I say, why do shit, bitch, if you finna get caught? Bitch, I know I ain't trying to whoop the whoop somebody and then go do 30 for... Hell, nah. So it's like, bitch, you shoot somebody, bitch, you gonna tell them that, man, you got females and niggas around here like, man, don't mess with him. He done, he got two, three bodies under his belt. How the hell you know he got two, three bodies under his belt? Bitch, you ain't supposed to know. Bitch, you go to church, free man. How you know what he get into? How you know how he vibing? That what I'm saying. Like, it's too much capping going on. Too much talking. Too much shit sitting around these females. Now they go tell somebody else. She, you don't know the next nigga. She fucking she, the police now. He, he, done, he done got caught with three ounces last week. But he looking for the right lick to get back straight with the police, because the police told my boy, you looking at 10 years, boy, you got caught with three ounces, you, what you got for us? He chilling with a bitch worried about pussy, the bitch just start telling him about a smacker, he like, what's his name? What? Bitch, he done, whoop de whoop de whoop. next time you know, you, you wonder why they ran your house five in the morning, bitch, because you done told motherfuckers too much stuff. You done told the wrong person, not knowing who the wrong person is. Everybody. Shout out to everybody on here. Don't forget, man, hit the super chat. You feel me? If you watch it on the other thing, don't forget to like and share. Yeah, man. Who's the wrong person? Anybody. Everybody. Because if you smacking, ain't nobody supposed to know you smacking versus you and whoever that's breaking bread. But we ain't trying to promote that. I'm just talking about this shit crazy out here. How bitches smacking people and getting caught. Like, bitch, y'all might well chill. Vibe. You feel me? Like, bitch, that ain't worth it because, bitch, everything getting solved, bitch. Everything getting recorded. Your cell phones tap. Your computers tap. Your house tap. Everything tap. Bitch, like, bitch, you feel me? We need everybody talking about getting money again. Ain't nobody talking about getting money. They talking about they smackers. I'm a killer. I'm a stealth. Bitch, y'all got to chill. These boys watching. Them fans watching. They waiting. They plotting. They leeching. They tippy-toeing. Touch your nose. Yeah. That's why I say it don't make no sense. I'm like, damn. That case got soft. This case gets soft. So guess what? They not. The police ain't doing the work. The FBI ain't doing the work. We doing the work. We tell her telling. We in class raising our hand up. I know. I know who did who. I know who did what. I know who did what. Telling. Snitching. Hi. Right. Yeah. That's how it's going down. People is 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 and and then they they they, they give it money to snitch, man. You know how many people want that money? Two, three, four, five bands, ten G's. Bitch, niggas call call up, start lying. Hey, bitch, I ain't gonna lie. I think I seen who did it. I think it was Lil Ray Ray. Bitch, start making up names on you, man. So that's why I say, if you in the rap game, bro. Because like I say, ain't no rap thing. It been out here like that. Just the rap made it more. Because it, it, it's like another way to get money. Another more people dealing with each other. So it, that's really what it is. But you just got to know how to rock, how to move. You feel me? And be careful. Because a lot, of, a lot of people out here crash dummies too. Trying to fit in. Smacking people for the next person that don't give a fuck about you. You know how much little snappers, smackers out there in jail saying... The person they was smacking for, forgot about them. Send them a little commissary first year, two year. Like, imagine you smacking somebody and you catch 20 years and they rolled out for good a year and a half and then you don't hear from them no more. Is that really worth your life going? You feel me? We got to get this shit right. People, people promoting job. Working ain't cool. Bitch, get you a job, bro. Pump that money up. Open a little business, bro. 
You feel me? Rap too, but just don't make that bitch like, like your only hustle. Cause it seems like bitch can't even live through that shit, bitch. You feel me? So it's like not everybody get to be on that level where, but you got police around, security for you. So now you doing big venues, you ain't gotta worry about that. But if you out there still getting your feet wet, you like like your your cloud big, but your music ain't ain't big yet. Like like remember when X X Tacion was first starting that R I P that boy X X Tacion, how he was in them little spots where. He was a he was getting like a little five ten band a show, but he still was accessible. Where they the t um, security opened the back door and let somebody in, and he got sucker punched and, and, and passed out. See, there's a lot of artists on that that's on that level. You feel me? And then you know that you know like shit happened where you still got access to get touched. So it's like all that shit. Look how much rappers getting killed at shows, getting swung on. Like bitches really losing their life at shows. Like where it's supposed to be a family function, kids function, events. Club events, is bitches losing their life. Why is guns getting in? Whoever's throwing the venue ain't paying enough. Guess what? Security got to eat. If, 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 people, if he charging people three hundred to bring their own guns in, he get twenty people tonight or a hundred people tonight. He rich. Let's say he charging three, four hundred or five hundred to let your gun in there, and he got a thousand people trying to, or even four hundred people, or even three, or even ten, trying to pay five hundred to let the gun in. You think he ain't gonna get that cheese? He probably only got paid two, three hundred tonight. He about to make stacks tonight? Man, they own that. So it's like, shit get tough, bro. You feel me? Everybody getting touched everywhere. Everything getting solved everywhere because why everybody's talking to everybody. There's a lot of snitching going on on social media. And all the police got to do is sit back and, and read. Read the comments and read your inbox. You feel me? You got people in your inbox talking to you like they, 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 they think... This yo shit, like, who, who you think invented? Man, people forget, like, throw back these social media sites. You only could have been on one phone. When they first, when, when, you, when you log in, you only could have been logged in on one phone. Now you can be logged in on 20 different phones at one time on that same account. Why? So the police can lock in. Throw back Facebook. You couldn't have no full Facebook page open. I'm on, on, like, four different phones. It's going to tell you you already logged in from another phone. You feel me? Now... Bitch, you could be on that person's Facebook watching them, messaging people. Why you think they made it like that? Yeah, not for you. You thinking it's cool. Oh, shit, I could be on two phones. No, the police keeping track. FBI, everybody that's talking reckless on there, they lurking. They watching. They peeping. Don't forget hit that super chat, man. Support the super chat, man. And if you're on the books, too, don't forget. Hit the cash app. Tip it toe podcast. You know, money sign. You feel me? Cash app. But, you know, if you're on YouTube, don't any little donation count. Any little donation count, baby. Yeah, man. So it's crazy out here, man. We got to know how to move. We got to know how to start talking to our neighbors, man. Like, we got to take it back. Like, it's okay to say what's up. It's okay to smile. Like, we be too mad all the time. Even me, sometimes I catch myself too mad. We, we got to get back to being happy. You ever see white folks? How you doing? We got to get back happy, bro. We got to get back to it, like loving each other, loving ourselves. Because if we don't love ourselves first, how the hell we going to love somebody else if we don't love ourselves? Because we can't, we can't say we love each other. Look how we killing each other. You feel me? So that's why I said we got to start loving each other and then love, love our neighbors. Damn it, bro. This shit deep. You feel me? This shit deep. And they ain't on no lick. I'm on I'm on water today. I'm on Zaza though. But the thing is, the, the whole conversation started because the, the family, what's his name? Um they used to be with um with Nutsi. He had got he had died, remember he kept getting shot, but they just found out two people got arrested in his case. It's like, damn. Everybody getting caught now. You can't do nothing. And you feel me? And you think people will let up? People shooting daylight. You go look at the HD highest camera, 4K, 6K, watching you, sweating on, watching you look back, pull out the chopper, pull out the stick, and just, <clears throat> you feel me? So it's like, you got to know, you feel me, how to move. And like I said, you, we got to start loving each other. Because if we don't love each other, that shit dead. If we don't love each other, bro, start from the hood or whatever hood you stay because now everybody's in the hood. So you feel me? Give it back. Start, start looking out for the hood. 
give back. You feel me? Like, touch your nose. It's shit crazy out here, bro. Like, look at how the other artists, the FBG, the other FBG. You feel me? Look at um, motherfucking trouble. It don't stop, bro. It don't stop. You feel me? You was a target. They know who you is. You was shining. You was gleasing. I don't like that. I got to do something about that. Touch your nose. Just let me hit the size out, bro. Don't forget, man. Hit the super chat support. You on the books, hit the cash app. Tip it toe. Money sign. Tip it toe podcast. If you on the books. Yeah, man. And don't forget, man. Yo, follow my OnlyFans, too. I got an OnlyFans. We're going to be doing freaky interviews, man. Crazy out here, bro. What the hell we going to do? You feel me? It's a lot to do, but we got to start from somewhere. You feel me? We got to start from somewhere, and that's the only way it's going to get better. Start from somewhere. Touch your nose. Mm-mm-mm. Don't forget, y'all. Like and subscribe. Reshare. Don't forget to support. Tippy toes. We out of here, man. Touch your nose.